Yeah, Shalom, coming to you in the name of Yahweh Bashem, Yashai Bashem, Raka Kudash, double honor to the apostles and the elders at Great Millstone. And salutes unto the Akim that continue to push the word in truth and in sincerity. Yeah, um, uh, one of the brothers, you know, <laughs> sent a video of uh, Rakar, the GOCC, you know, doing music, man. And he can't even sing too good. <laughs> And um, yeah, you know, I looked him up. I don't really watch GOCC at all, to be honest. But um, you know, here's a little bit of him. His voice is dry, man. He's missing that flavor, man. He, his voice sounds flat. He can't really sing. And you see the thing is, right, <laughs> this is like, GOCC is like one, I would say half a step above, you know them, them, uh, I'll call them black people, but they follow, you know, strictly Jewish customs, they basically join Judaism, and yeah, we won't, you know, like we had to go to them for some of the basic things which they stole. You know, and we, you know, our elders, elders, you know, and stuff like that. But, I mean, these guys haven't grown. They haven't elevated, man. They're just on that. They're literally one, half a step or one step above, you know, so black people that join Judaism, man. You know, they got the nice congregations and the, get togethers and the singing and the song and the dance and stuff I actually know a girl that I went to school with years ago like seven eight nine years ago and um her and her mother actually left the IUIC which is another interesting story but I'll save that for another time but yeah man the GOCC you know they're there because their family's dead like if I point at this guy you know, does this guy believe, you know, he probably believes because that might be his cousin, you know, or that might be his mother or his auntie, you know, you got to believe, you know, for yourself, man. And when you, that, that when you invite that whole Christianity vibe into the mix, he, he, first of all, it's not the truth, but whatever you do believe is because of unity, okay? What the scriptures say is join a multitude to do evil, man. And, um, you know, Ricardo GOCC, yeah, they, that's just evil, man. They ain't the truth. They're a big fat joke. But if you look, look at these people in the congregation, you single them out. Why, you know, you, you say you're an Israelite. You believe that you're an Israelite. You believe, you know, <laughs> well, they, they believe a lot of madness. But just single them out on their belief. Why do you believe that? Or probably a lot of them wouldn't be able to tell you. They'll be looking at their 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 family members because they've just joined. You know that's that's madness, man. But man, this I'm watching this video a little bit of a laugh. You know, the guy can't sing. You know, maybe he's not an Israelite. <laughs> I'm joking. I'm just joking, man. But hey, listen, this is one I wanted to get into. This is Romans chapter three and three. You know, and fuck the GOCC, man. You know, I just said that as a joke, but on, on a serious note, man, you know, Romans 3 and 3 says, For what if some did not believe? Shall their unbelief make the faith of the Most High without effect? Okay, because a lot of people are going to, you know, have been saying that continually. Oh, you guys are talking shit. It's not the truth. You know, Christianity is the way, whatever the case may be. But if some belief, does that make the faith of the Most High without effect? Just because brother so and so or sister so and so doesn't believe, now all of a sudden your 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 belief in in that is now shaky, man. Okay, so just because somebody don't believe, don't mean that this ain't the truth. The faith of the Most High about effect meaning that is void. Hell no, man. 
Okay. God forbid, let the most high be true, but every man a liar, as it is written, that thou might be justified in thy sins and mightest overcome when thou art judged. So yeah, man, if somebody can't get it or they don't believe that this is the truth, then fuck them, man. Okay. Simple as, man. Okay. Let the most high be true, man. You know, when a certain guy, oh, I can't see it, brother, or I don't believe, you know, and then you start getting shaky. <laughs> well, have you have you allowed that next man's doubt to, to dampen your faith? Okay, because at the end of the day, the scriptures tell us in verse 4, man, that every man's a liar, and let the most high be true. Okay, this is Romans chapter 14, verse 5, and it says, One man esteemeth. Uh, one day above another Another esteem of every day alike Let every man be fully persuaded in his own mind You know, we got to be fully persuaded In our own minds Not because brother, this brother believes Or that brother believes Or, you know, the brethren Oh yeah, you only have faith Or you're only strong when you're around the Akim No, you got to believe Okay You know As them, them rappers say in their songs sometimes When they're spitting bars I'm on my Jack Jones and I feel ten man strong. You know, that's how we gotta be spiritually. When we're by ourselves, we gotta feel like we're with an army. Okay, because of the faith that we have in the Lord, man. But it all goes back to how much faith the Lord gave us, man, any in the first place anyway. But yeah, man, um you know, we gotta believe for ourselves, man. Okay? You gotta be fully persuaded. I've gotta be fully persuaded, man. Cause the time's coming when the outcome ain't gonna be together, man. It won't be every man alone, you know. Scripture says that you'll be as one walking in the city by yourself, roughly paraphrasing. How much more you gonna see Akim? You know, that ain't gonna happen, man. You know, so we all gotta be persuaded in our own minds, man. And, you know, thank the Lord for the 100% truth, man. You know. Okay, and time to making songs, you know. Israel. Yeah, come on, man. G O C C is a joke. I U I C is a joke. And I know pe I know people. Like I said, I know that girl and her mother that were in the I U I C. Okay, I know I got first hand um, accounts of what the hell went down. And I'm talking about the London school, man. Okay, and 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 the girl and her mother left I U I C because of mix ups and bullshit, man. Okay. Amongst all the other situations, man. So you, you, you Israelite camps, man. You know you may be pushing Israel, but if you're about bullshit, then <laughs> the Lord is exposing y'all, man. And this was years ago. You know, well before Joy Morgan and all of that. I'm talking four, three, four years ago, man. You know. She told me, yeah, and she didn't. She she didn't really like me because, I, you know. <laughs> You know, I I wanted to talk to her, but I didn't even know she was awoken to Israel like that. You know, and then she told me that she, um I might not like her back because um she was feeling my vibe, and she says I might not I might not like her because she's considered to be a part of what people would call a cult, but it's not really a cult. So I said, what is it? And she said, well I'm an Israelite, and I uh from the school of I U I C, and I said, oh shit, <laughs> okay. You know, I, I'm an Israelite too, but guess what? I'm with GMS, you know, I'm, I'm part of GMS. And, um, you know, she wasn't really <laughs> feeling that, man. As soon as I said GMS, then she wasn't feeling my vibe no more. And that's all right. Fuck her, man. You know? <laughs> but um, she ended up telling me years later that her and her mom wound up leaving IUIC London, man. Because of some bullshit, okay? But, um... <laughs> You know, they're women, so who cares? But you know, if they if they get with men of the Lord, they get with men of the Lord. But let's just say that it was two guys, all right, a father and a son. If they left, would they still be pushing the truth? Would they still be going out on the highways and the byways? Would they still be, you know, doing this, do doing the doing the work? Okay, so you got to be persuaded. So we have to be persuaded in our own minds, man. You can't be motivated for next man steam or for next man fuel or for next man oil, okay? You gotta have the reserves. I gotta have the reserves myself, okay? It's so lucky, man. It's what two thirty in the morning, man. I'm tired. 
you know, but just wanted to push that out there, man. For what if some do not believe? Shall their unbelief make the faith of the most high without effect? Okay. You know, the scriptures also speak about a great falling away, man. A lot of people go and leave this Israelite thing, if you will, because of the oppression, man. You know, that's going to come. So we got to believe, you know, continue to pray. You know, and have belief and be con be persuaded, man, in our own minds, okay? You can't make it off a next man's fuel. Anyways, with that, man, it's a couple of words I want to throw out there with that. I'm going to say shalom.